pattern search. In this lesson you're going to learn where you can perform a pattern search on any products in your hot opportunity list that you might think has a patent. Disclaimer, this is very important. I am not an attorney or a patent expert and the following training is provided for informational purposes only. It does not establish any specific legal advice or recommendations. If you are not certain about any specific search or patent inquiry, you should consult a patent or trademark attorney. So what is a patent? A patent basically gives the patent owner for a number of years a monopoly on the terms of the patent. This means that the patent owner can prevent others from manufacturing or selling anything covered in the patent. This means you need to avoid any product that has an existing patent. Patent pending means someone has applied for a patent but it has not been granted yet. If you find a product with a patent pending, then you should still avoid the product. Now you can always monitor the patent to see if it gets approved or not. However, this is probably going to be longer than you would ever want to wait. Patent information. The best way to perform patent searches on your prospective products is the official US government site. Now if you're selling in the UK or Germany, you need to find the patent search site for your country. The link to the site is www.uspto.gov. This site has a huge amount of free information and it also contains two different patent searches, patent overview and information. If you go to this URL and don't worry, it will be in the PDF below this lesson or you can simply look at the screen and type it out. You will find there is some very useful information including a guide on how to perform a preliminary patent search. The patent searches. First there is the approved patent search. Use product keywords to search the database to see if there are any approved patents for the product. You can use this URL or again it's in the PDF that you're going to download below this lesson. Pending patent search. Use product keywords to search the database again. However this is for pending patents and remember if you find anything in the pending patent search we recommend you still avoid that product. And this is the URL for that search again, it's in the PDF below this lesson. If you are concerned about a product in your list that it might have a patent, then you should run both searches and not just the approved one. When and what to search. We only recommend you do this once you have your list of hot opportunities. In other words, don't waste your time doing a patent search on a product that you haven't verified is a viable product. I normally only do it for the final three choices. It saves time, it's that simple. If after your first product is up and running and you want to go back to your hot opportunity list, then again, if you choose one of the products on that list, then run the patent search if you're concerned. The vast majority of products on Amazon which are sold by multiple sellers and match our criteria are unlikely to have a patent. However, if you are unsure in any way whatsoever after running a patent search, then you need to contact a patent attorney. One more time, the disclaimer. I am not an attorney or patent expert and this lesson was provided for informational purposes only. It does not establish any specific legal advice or recommendations. If you are not certain about any specific search or patent inquiry, you should consult a patent or trademark attorney. But that's it for this lesson. Take care.